he's like as if you're playing in the backyard with all your friends and then your big brother comes in and it's just unfair. You know, the first thing that stood out to me was just how big he was, like physically. He's one of those quiet and uh, quiet giants. Julius Peppers, who goes six six. Yeah, he's uh, yeah, he's one of those freaks. A freakish athlete, Julius Peppers. You know, just does things that are, you know, you just kind of say, wow. At an age when most players are thinking about retirement. Julius Peppers set a career high in forced fumbles while scoring two touchdowns. 34 years old, 13 years in the league, and he can do stuff like that. So he's rushing the right tackle, and he did his one arm stiff arm move, and he just picked him up off his feet and threw him down. Just brute force. Third down, I went inside and bull rushed his dude and put him on his ass. I don't know who that is. I'm sorry, right tackle. I wonder if he's going to be on the 100. He's constantly changing his game. You know, he's constantly getting better at other stuff to adapt. He wasn't dropping back in the coverage early in, the, in his career. Now he's being able to drop back in the coverage. Julius Peppers arrived on the scene. He was getting sacks all over the place, stripping the ball, running the ball back. Only player in the NFL with at least a sack, interception, forced fumble, and defensive TD this season. You know, when you take a look at all of it put together, wow, what an impact he's had for the Packers. He had more touchdowns than some offensive players, so how can you not say he's still performing at that level? Against us this year, he had a pick six, which you don't see a lot. This top 100 performer topped 100 yards on his two pick sixes. Intercepted down the left side. Across 25, 20, 15, 10, 5 into the end zone. It is a touchdown. Receivers can't catch him, so it's crazy because he's so big. And he's running away from receivers who are trying to catch up with him after interception happened. How many former defensive ends can take that ball to the house? Not many. That boy got two pick sixes. That's crazy. First one, he tried to Lambo leap. He didn't make it, so we gave him a hard time. The second one, he made it. So it was fun to see. I knew when they got him, I was like, how did, you know, how did everybody let him go there? Boy, Julius Peppers just absolutely splattered Josh McCown. The sack, the strip, and the recovery. <laughs> it's simple. Julius Peppers would not be denied. I think there's a lot of gas left in the tank. It's not fun playing against Julius, I'll tell you that. 